the Edmonton Humane Society has something called the Training Academy. Okay. And this is primarily the actual classes are for dogs and dog owners, but we also have some advice through a behavior hotline for cat owners and any other kind of behavior issue with any other kind of animal. So uh, you can sign up for, let's talk, behavior training with, with dogs. Okay. We have puppy training classes. It's so important when you bring a puppy home yes. that you do take it to behavior training classes. It can learn to be properly socialized. Bite inhibition. They want to bite you teach them that you don't and 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 give them some toys that they should be doing that with mm -hmm. um, you teach puppies how to properly approach people so starting yes. at such a young age we have something called feisty fido classes for dogs that are a little bit more feisty <laughs> I love the these name. names it's funny. yeah we <laughs> have one for uh, general behavior mm -hmm. so just obedience training uh, agility and oh. disc flying these are for dogs that <gasps> super dogs that exactly <laughs> you can make your own super dog and we have one for uh, pit bull classes because oh, it's yes. such a misunderstanding breed and we help people that have just recently adopted one of them how they can integrate the dog into society with all of the uh, incorrect stigma beliefs. Attached. and then these are very strong willed dogs they're wonderful they're gentle but they get distracted very easily and you have to keep them focused yes so yes. anyway you learn all of that in that of course so Wonderful. we have those training classes you can find out all the information on our website which is edmontonhumanesociety.com yes and the behavior training line is 780-491-3 Three five two one. So for any help with your behavior issues, little sneeze. A little sneeze is a little cold, but this kitten has no behavior issues, as you can no, see. He's good. <laughs> he likes to be on TV. It's fantastic. So now we're going to move on to the. Small. Small animals. Small animals. So if you're not ready for a cat yes. or you're not ready for a dog or they don't fit into your lifestyle, we have other alternatives. Really wonderful pets. Fantastic. We'll go check it out. 